Hello everyone, and my name is Horror Dude, and welcome to Let's Play Mental Hospital Eastern Block. Now, this is a continuation of Mental Hospital 2. Um, I haven't played that game, but I heard this one was definitely a very good addition to the storyline. So, without further ado, let's get right into it. Pick the only stage that we can here. <laughs> it seems this is the place where David was found dead. But where did he lose his camera? When he was trying to leave this hospital. But what happened to him? I have to find out. Find his video records? But we have to be more careful. The way this case was hushed makes you think it wasn't an ordinary tramp who killed him there has to be more to it and I bet there is alright so we're just walking around this deep dark dank place here let me see I need to find the camera okay well apparently that's the way out so I'll just have to remember that. I'll just have to remember that. Okay. Now, I've never played this, so I don't know what to expect. At all. So I'm just going to be... Uh, checking all doors and everything. Everything. Yeah. Uh, well, that's locked. Hmm. That's locked. I'm right up on the door and it's not doing anything. What's going on here? There should be a hand or something. Why is it not letting me in this room? Am I in a glitch? Uh, I don't know what's going on here. Everything seems to be working fine. Oh, there we go. I don't know what that was about. But we're just going to move on! Alright, so, really not much in this room, and I don't like that, I don't like that at all, walking around in this decrepit old asylum, <laughs> testing my reflexes. Try to figure out how to get back to my flashlight. Why is it? There we go. Okay. There we go. Do I go through here? Okay, well apparently I can! I can close the doors behind me. Okay, well that works. I 
don't know where I'm going. I, I know I'm looking for some sort of camera. But, uh, don't... What the hell is that? What is that? What is that? Nothing in here. Nothing in here. Nothing in here. Is there like little random things for me to... What was the point of coming in here? There had to have been some reason. There had to have been some reason behind this door opening. I wonder if it's like those amnesia games where uh, you can check drawers and whatnot. So let's see if I can. Oh, well, guess not. Maybe it's just uh, to throw you off. I'm not. I don't know. I'm not really sure. starting to get the feeling like I might want to pull out my gun. Um, maybe. Alright, well, so far I haven't run into anything, so let's just continue the path that we were going. locked doors back there so my guess is I'm supposed to backtrack possibly figure out okay well it's not that one not that one either okay well I thought for sure that this key would have been from one of these doors. Can I go this way? That's weird. That's just fucking weird. Okay, well, there's another door. Can I? Doesn't seem like I could even access this one. Nope. Guess not. Does this go anywhere? Yeah, it does. Okay. I still think that there's something to this door. I don't know why it wouldn't let me... There we go. I haven't quite figured out the whole mechanic about changing the weapon to... Okay, well, I got my gun out because I'm in this weird-ass room. And there's got to be a reason behind it, so... And I just busted a cat. Okay, well, I think I can get around this way. No? Okay, well... I 
There's just no reason for me to be in here. What is the reason behind this door? I don't see anything. I hear a bunch of weird fucking noises. Ah, oh, I'm not trying to do that. Great. I only had three bullets. Oh, let's... Let's... Switch back... To... If it ever lets me do it. There we go. Okay, because I can swing this thing like a weapon, so, until I find more ammo, I will just, yeah, oh, well, that's locked, all right, well, apparently, I must go through that other door, Should be closer to the door now. Okay, well. I don't like that. All right, well, we are in the dark again, searching through random things here. this room. Is anybody here? Hello? Look down. Fuck. Yeah, there's got to be a reason for it. I should be able to go around. I'm going to look at everything. I'm going to look at those desks. I'm looking at all sorts of shit. What the fuck is that? Where's that coming from? What the hell was that?
a lot of blood around there. Empty cans. Taking it slow, people. Taking it slow. So far, there's no points to this room either, except to creep me the hell out. There's nothing in there. Alright, well, we'll continue on our way. I'd really like to know what was making that noise. And this is where I came from, so I'm going this way. Alright. Oh, shit. There we go. Don't know where he went. But he came from this way. So let's see what the hell he was running from. What is that? Okay, well, so far we haven't encountered it. That's locked. That's probably that other door. and everything so no stone unturned we're looking for a camera and so far I, I, I don't have anything I found a gun that's it I found a gun I don't like that different directions. I'm going to start with the door at the end of the hall here. It, it would make sense to try this one first. At least I think so. Oh my god. Not so sure I want to do this. Let's back up. See if any of these other doors do anything. I don't want to go down there just yet, unless I absolutely have to. And the way things look, I might absolutely have to. Locked. Not at all. 
Okay. Alright, we're gonna take it slow because this is about when whatever is gonna happen will start happening. and then trails everywhere. That's wonderful. I love the way he decorated this place. What the fuck? Okay, well, we gotta keep moving forward to get out of this. It's the only way. One door. Alright. It's better than the options from before. Okay, well, this is a bit different. Now, who in their right mind would have gone this far into an insane asylum? I'm doing this because I'm sent on a recovery mission. Locked. This is apparently a recovery mission uh, for this camera, so there's some kind of evidence as to uh, whatever went down here, uh, but I am not at all certain what the deal is, like, wow, the door is blocked by some mechanism. Hmm, what kind of mechanism do you speak of? Let the evil out, once and for all. <laughs> I'm just kidding, no. Um. All right. I think one of the most unnerving things about this is all these... Random TVs that don't do anything. Can I turn it off? Nope. Okay. That's very strange. Go so fuck yourself. You're not gonna scare me that easily. Body parts, some leg. Huh. Showing off a little leg there. Okay. Blocked by some mechanism. Parts racing. I wonder if all of them make some kind of noise. In all this darkness, I could have easily ran right past the camera that I'm currently searching for. But I needed to find the origin of that noise. I heard something. I heard something. 
something. I don't know what that was. I have no idea what that was. Treat him here, huh? Yes, I'm all about that. Must be getting closer to something. Flashing lights.
Not creepy at all. Not at all. Hearing a lot of stuff. But, uh, let me just get the hell out of here, like right now. There you have it, folks. Uh, this is Mental Hospital 2 Eastern Block. Um, and I'm about out of time for this episode. Uh, but there will be more of this uh, in the future. So, I'm Horror Dude. And... I'd like to say that this game is pretty well uh, made. Uh, the graphics are really, really good. The developer, uh, I believe, put in a lot of time for, uh, uh, with this. Uh, you can just tell uh, by the way everything looks. Yeah, I plan on going further into this uh, in another episode, so please stay tuned. Uh, I'm Horror Dude, and uh, until next time, bye-bye.